you're going to need a tool set, your X tool tool set, or you can just use this if you have all the pieces you need in there. Q tips will be beneficial to get into the small places. A little bit of water in a bowl, you don't need a lot. Air duster. And some paper towels. Once you get all those things, you can go ahead and start getting the laser out and preparing that. But I have the 40 watt laser. And if you look at the top of it, you're gonna have two screws. You'll have one here and one here. You have to undo those. This will tilt forward and come off. And then you have to detach the air assist as well as the power supply. All right, so I took the laser off. Um, now you have two pieces that you need to detach. This and this. And they both just pop right off. So mine's not gonna be as dusty because I actually didn't clean this, or I cleaned this not too long ago. So you have that and that. You have the hose here. You have your little plate. This is the uh, lens protector. So this can be cleaned separately. Um, or if you have an extra one, you can pull them out and swap them. But if you want to clean this, dip it in alcohol and then uh, go through that process. But you can unscrew them, check the lens and make sure that it looks okay. Cause sometimes you'll get little dots in there. I have another video for that if you want to watch that, but let's uh, jump into this. Now I like to use a really damp cloth to wipe off all the surfaces. Just kind of get all the dust that's gone up in there. And then you want a dry towel to wipe these off. Get any moisture that you might have still on any of these items. One, to, oh, to prevent corrosion, but two, you're dealing with electronics, so you don't want anything to sit on there, especially when you provide power back to it. However, because I use this damp towel, nothing is actually left on this. All right, so we can go ahead and start placing this back on. That just slides right over. And plug this air assist hose back in. All right, and then with this, you have an entrance and you have an exit. It just sits on there like that. All right, so we've cleaned that side. Now we'll get to the harder side. So for this, this is where I like to use this tool set. Go through here. Where are you? And then last time I said this was like a two, I think this is metric, but I'm not sure. All right, take these off. There's gonna be four on the outside and four on the inside that you have to remove. Make sure you place these somewhere safe so that you don't lose them. All right, we'll start with the uh, cover and go ahead and just wipe off any dirt that you have on there. So we took off the four screws on the outside. So when this was staying on there, you took off these. Those actually connect to the fans underneath. So you removed these four already. So now we have to do the four internal ones. So one, two, three, four. With these, you have little plastic pieces. I don't know if you can see that very well, but make sure you don't lose those. Again, take the damp cloth.
All right, now it's time to reassemble this. So we'll put this back together and then we'll put this laser back in.